Ladies and gentlemen, this is the winner of the Monday Funday reveal from this week. The question was, how long is the Gasparilla Marathon? It's kind of a funny because it's the same as every other marathon. So Dawn, you kind of got that joke. Uh, but what we wanted to do is do it right here live from uh, Gasparilla Day Parade. And uh, we have our, so, um, these are all the contestants. There are 34, 36 of you guys today. And uh, as you can see, lots of stuff going on. Uh, with the boat parade, Carly's picking out the winner now. Uh, with the boat parade uh, being such a windy day, uh, there's not many boats, so uh, the parade's gonna be crazy, but the boats, not so much. All right, so uh, here we go. Uh, we gotta be super quick, because it's cray cray down here. Sue, 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 you won! Ladies and gentlemen, Sue won! I'm glad you didn't bring your skiff down here. It would have been, you know, you know, cat size. It's crazy here. Anyway, uh, ladies and gentlemen, we're really excited um, that Tampa has been able to at least get back out and enjoy its Gasparilla festivities. Um, we're going to still have a few more Gasparilla questions um, in the next, what, two, three weeks, I think. Uh, but we want to uh, we want to celebrate the fact that we have a great city. Lots of people are able to come out here and really enjoy themselves. Obviously, Corona is still a thing. These people have all clearly been vaccinated, clearly are all uh doing the social distancing of six feet and um you know what this is the reason why everybody says they want to be in florida and then some people say florida's crazy so either way florida man florida woman here for you uh james and air the age who cares carly and air carly williams tampa central carly uh yes tampa, tampa central uh which is really just over that way a little bit uh it's really good to uh see uh, tampa at its finest again um, hope you guys have a great week, and we'll uh, we'll catch up with you next Monday.